Hi. It's so nice to meet you at last. Yes, I've received your inquiry form for your customised journal. And today's appointment is to choose the papers that will go inside and any embellishments that you like. So I'm going to start by showing you a traditional pad of uh, acid-free paper. So I thought the best thing to do is for me to just flick through the pad and when you see something that you like, if you can sort of stop me and we'll uh, make a note of it. But yeah. So I know you chose the thicker journal out of the three images that I sent you of things we've designed in the past. I'll just pop them on the screen just to make sure we've got the right one. So it's the third one. Yeah. Okay, right. So I'll just start by moving the pages so we have the Christmas trees. That's quite a traditional one. Can you see that? Yeah. So we have baubles and evergreens. You like that one? Okay. Yeah, that will look nice. It's quite a, a traditional red and green. Okay, this has got some little robins on it, can you see? Yeah, keep going. That's, you like this one? This has got the snowflakes on a green background. Yeah. So we've got baubles and evergreen. We've got green snowflakes. So if you can choose about five because these will go in the signatures and that particular journal has 150 pages approximately. You can have more if you like but each signature has a cover and these will be the signature pages plus there'll be a couple of other ones as well. Yeah okay let's keep going then. Like this holly. Mm -hmm. So I know you said your family member had a liking for animals as well. So we'll see what we can do about that. Yeah, this is quite nice. The green. It's got like a bauble print on it. Christmas decorations. stripe that goes quite nicely with the holly that you've chosen shall I pop that one down yeah that's the rocking horses again Christmas trees. Mm -hmm. Let's write that down. Just counting how many we have now. So we've got one, two, three, four, five. So I think we've got six there. That should be enough for the signature pages and a few more. But what I'll actually do before we actually go ahead is I'll do a mock-up of the pages that you've chosen and send you like um, an electronic version of how it's how it's going to look. Yeah. 
Okay, so um, we have to choose the fabric embellishments that are going to go on the front. So I'll try and replicate as much as I can the thicker Santa coloured junk journal that you saw, which was in a hardback book. So I'll just show you a few of the embellishments that you could have on if you like. So are you wanting to stick to the traditional greens and reds? Mm -hmm. Okay. So gold, um, you might want to consider gold because that goes quite well and it's quite Christmassy. So if they like butterflies, I don't know if they like butterflies or not. No, you're not sure about that. Now this is quite nice, it's like a glittery ribbon, what we could do with this is we could make it into a ruffle to go across the front, yes that's, that's um, something we could consider, I'll write that down. do you think to have a glitter theme this one's also glittery can you see with the burgundy this might like look nice with some of the colours that you've chosen especially the dark green backgrounds I pop that one down as well were you wanting the journal to have a closure on it there's a few different options you could have the traditional thick red ribbon that they just use to undo the journal with but it doesn't actually have an eyelet through the journal cover or we could pop an eyelet through the cover and then you, it would be on permanently and it could close with something like this. This is a red trim, uh, it's a vintage foil, it's almost like a shoelace. Yeah. So we could, we could have this on through the eyelet and then we could wrap the journal up and tie it with a bow for gifting. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'll just write that down. Now this is quite in keeping with the red hardback journal that you've chosen this would look nice on the front we have the it's black like an organza material and it has a traditional um winter berry and tiny uh fur cone just on the front there that would look nice or there's another a gold with the little cherub on this is quite traditional as well so yeah so it's going to be a red hardback cover with the Santa image and you just need to choose which bow to go on yeah I think two would be too much really but uh, yeah well you have a think about it and then you can email me later and let me know which one This is an option. Um, you could have this fabric on and then the Santa image on the top of it. It's like a woven material. This is quite nice. Yeah. It's a nice 
the papers to go inside the journal. So a lot of the papers that we use are coffee dyed or tea dyed. Uh, you can also have some vintage book pages popped inside as well. So these are from a 1950s annual and you can have Christmas So here are some coffee dyed pages. Now these have got a special pattern on them. But they have a wonderful sound when you turn the pages.
So do you have any questions? Yes, um, from, so what will happen today is I will go back and I will create a mock-up of the journal that you've decided that you want. I'll then email you and I'll write down how many pages and I'll send like an electronic mock-up version, a digital version of it, how it's going to look. And if you okay it, and then we go ahead should take about eight weeks to from start to finish so you know you'll have it sort of mid-october in time for christmas yeah is that okay well that's great well it's been lovely to 